Hi guys, welcome to IT Networking and Wingate Com Server High CPU. So, how to resolve? I giving you step by step. First step is run memory memory diagnostic. So, first step is guys Windows R and type md sch ad dot exe and then okay. Then guys. Click to reset now and check the problem. So please wait few minutes. So look at this. Uh, no problem found. Okay. And some percentage were uh, running. Test bypass overall test status two percent. This is fully scan your systems. You have any issues in your system, so find out the system diagnostics tools. If you select escape, so automatically exit. If you select F1, so more options to to troubleshoot option. So guys please wait a so few minutes so running this fast the one of the two steps will be complete and then automatically to restart when your system automatically restart and this is welcome screen so wait a few minutes to start your system then guys second solution so press the windows r and open the run dialog and then type ms config and press the enter in the system configuration the window select services and hidden and disable all select one by one this is printer drivers do not read for the system configuration so Disable all and apply as an option. Do not restart wait few minutes. So complete all then check windows. So guys click to start one, go to setting go 
then click to windows update and if you have any pending update like this kb series is pending so firstly you have to install download and install okay and next solutions disable unnecessary uh, startup program from task manager so right click open task manager So this is startup. This is using your uh, RAM memory and all. So this is not required. Select this one and see. See, this is already disabled. That's why I show unable. Okay, select this. You can select disable. Okay. Like option. This is printer driver. So do not disable. Your printer is not working. So okay. So object power setting. So click to start button. Type control panel and hardware and sound. So firstly view by category hardware and sound and sorry back small and large option power options. Then change, select never, never. Then save, back, never. Again back and third last, never. And save changes to exit and close. Next check malware. Open Windows Security. Otherwise, you can run from here. It means Windows Defender. Double click to run. Virus and threat protection. Scroll down. Scan options. Run this ones. This is offline scanner. And tag about 15 minutes. And then click to scan right. Scan now. Almost uh, 15 minutes to scan your and depend over your uh, configurations and your C drives data. So. Then we will be automatically restart and then check it. Okay. Then, guys, last solution then, guys, click to start button and type CMD and then enter. You can try to run as an administrator, right click to run as administrator. So you are giving full permissions. Okay. Then guys I have some command to repair your some corrupted windows file. So this command I will give you a link in description so you directly copy paste. First command is sfc slash scan now. You look at in the screen. So some when you enter the some percentage like to start and uh, find out to any uh, uh, corrupted file. Okay. And then second second also check health your computers. And third, uh, third also uh, check and fourth restore your health. Okay, so all four four command is very important for your computers. Okay, and that all command I will give you in description so you can uh, manual type otherwise copy paste what you want to do. Okay, so almost first complete then second. Just copy and then paste. Copy and then paste. Okay. 
and then enter okay now third Then guys complete your uh, process, fourth count also done, then your system restart and then check your problem is 100% solved. Okay, bye bye, take care and you comment me have any issues so whatsapp me, number is on banner, bye.